We hired Frances Fisher as the female lead, and the show was always structured really as a romantic comedy uh, be, of, between husband and wife. That was really its, that was the reason for its success and its charm was that it wasn't really a family show. It was structured, as, it was done as a romantic comedy. Um, and uh, uh, and Frances Fisher was, and it was about two equals. And as important as Tim was, the wife was actually absolutely 100% as important. Um, and we did, we, we went, uh, you know, we did the table reading and Frances Fisher was like, really, really, she was good. But, and the show was funny and people were laughing and we knew we had a, a good show, but something just didn't feel right to, to me or to, to Bloomberg. And on, uh, on run through day, which is, you know, when we're rehearsing on, on Wednesday, the show was supposed to tape on Friday. Uh, we went through it and, and Stuart and I were just talking after and just said, you know, man, it's too bad because it's just, you know, she's really, she's a wonderful actress, but she's not really as funny as he is. So this is before you shot the pilot? This is as we're shooting the pilot. Wow. And uh, 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 this is on stage for the pilot. And we said, you know, we should, we should take another shot at finding somebody. We got like two days. We should, we should, we should take a shot. And uh, so we called Gene Blythe, who was my head of casting. And, uh, you know, we said, we, you know, it's just, he said, well, you know, she's really good. And he said, you know, she's believable. She's real. She's not, she wasn't born with the gift of comedy. And that just is something you're born with, uh, or you, at least you develop, but you have to have it. It's not a, it's not a rational thing. And, uh, uh, and the show will work even with her, but it won't be the same level of hit. And, uh, uh, and he said, I'll give one more time, one more try. And uh, he went back to his office and he, uh, you know, he had tried Pat Richardson before. She, she had just had given birth to twins or something. And she, she really, and her husband, Ray, who was also an actor, uh, Ray, the camera, he didn't want her to go back to work. And, uh, and he tried, decided to try one more time. And he called her manager and said, you know, it's a go pilot. You know, we're going to recast. You have to do any work. It's in two days. And, you know, we'll pay you you know, X amount of money, and, uh, and you got you to do it, got to do it. And she finally, she finally talked her into coming in. She came in the next day, and uh, she read, and she was great. And uh, we just said, that's, that's it. And we, we sadly fired Francis, and we pushed the show back two days, so to Tuesday, and uh, I think, and uh, that was it. And it was magic. And... Uh, uh, when the two of them were together, it just you know they had it, and uh, so that was that was the story of home improvement.